taking pictures. We're taking pictures. Yeah, Sean Roberts, <laughs> and that was Anne Marie on vocals. He's she's done a lot of uh, his albums, and uh, this is the first time she's been on G Rock's demo radio so, show. So be nice to her. <laughs> how you doing? Good. How are you? Thanks All for right. having me. All right. This is, he goes. I have a special guest. I'm thinking, uh, who's it gonna be? I would have been worried too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, why don't you guys tell me how you met? Um, well, basically, Anna and I met, um, let's see, back in 2001, I believe, and it was, um, she was doing a show, she was opening up for the Oak Ridge Boys, and uh, a, um, the drummer, the mutual friend of ours, Bobby Albright, you okay over there? Yep. All right. Uh, Bobby Albright was basically um, the drummer for her. And they needed a uh, a uh, another guitar player, uh, acoustic player, to help fill in for the sound for the show. So Bobby pulled me in and uh, mentioned to Anna and the band and the producer at the time um, that I was available to come in to do it. And I'm like, sure, no problem at all. So that's how Anna and I met, and uh, you know we've pretty much been friends ever since. And uh, you know she's a great songwriter herself. Uh, she's an award-winning songwriter as well too. That so. Bobby Albright, he's. Uh well known also, right? Bobby's pretty well known. Um, you know, Bob Yeah, that's better. There you go. Uh Bob's you know, Bob and I we've we've known each other for over twenty, twenty five years and everything and uh you know, Bobby and I we've always put each other on, on different projects. So if I know you know someone needs a drummer or anything like that, um and uh, you know, so I'll let Bobby know, hey, so and so is looking for a drummer, so is looking so, you know, whether it be for a studio gig or anything like that, or live shows or something. And Bobby would always pull me in, hey, someone's looking for a rhythm guitar player or something, so they, he would always pull me in for those. And so he got the gig for, for Anna's show, and uh, so that's how I got to know, in, to know Anna, because like I said, uh, he pulled me in for that and mentioned it to the producer. So what's going on uh, with you lately? Things are going good, you know. Yeah. I've been doing the house concert still, which, right. is, which is really an awful lot of fun. So tell the people about that. It's sure. a very unique thing that Sean Roberts does. I don't think too many people know that. Right. Well, basically what it is, is um, uh, I strictly do house concerts now, so I don't perform that much publicly anymore. So basically, it's really simple. It doesn't cost you anything. Um, you invite about 60 people, you know, because basically we know out of those 60, only about 15 to 20 are going to show up. So, you know, it's going to be a small... Well, my friends, it might be like five. Good enough. <laughs> and uh, so basically, you know, we go in and we sit in your living room, your backyard, however many people, you know, it'll fit, um, and pretty much do an hour show. Uh, it's kind of like a combination of Unplugged and Storytellers all in one. Uh, and I do um, songs from all three of my albums. Of course, the last one, which is called The Upside of Heartache, which got released uh, this past August. That I totally so. forgot. <laughs> and uh -huh. uh, so, you know, it's, it's, it's nice. And I'll do a couple of covers here and there and everything. Um, and it's an awful lot of fun. It's a very intimate setting. It's like a private show. Yeah, yeah. That's and pretty uh, cool. So it's nice. Like, so like I said, everybody's sitting down. We're sitting in the living room or the backyard or wherever the case may be. So I mean, I just did one up in, um, uh, in Solvang just recently. Uh, for a fan, and uh, we did it in his garage. He had like a three-car garage, and we wow. fit about 50 people in there, and we had an absolute. So you do like the whole PA system, and if need be, yeah. You know, if it's small enough, if that's the one where you like you stand up. It's not like when you. It could be either or. It just yeah, depends on the situation. So you know, it, it depends. If we're doing your living room, it'd probably be just you know myself and the acoustic guitar for doing the backyard because you got more people coming. Uh, yeah, I'll bring the PA and everything too. Isn't it much more intimate though to be sitting down, kind of like your? Yeah, yeah, like an unplugged I like, thing. I like those. Yeah, it can I go either or for me. Yeah. Yeah, it can go either or because I mean it, it depends also for me on the mood of the song, you know. So if it's a little bit more upbeat, I'll stand. If it's a little bit more mellow, I'll sit. Yeah. So yeah. Okay, so what do you guys want to play now or? Yeah, we can play something now for you if you like. Sure. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Here. Do you, you want to cool. scoot that way? Just a yeah, bit? I'll yeah. absolutely make a little more yeah, room for us here. That. Oh, here, I'll take it. Yeah, okay. That makes you look better. Okay. okay. Let's see. You are rocking with the G Rock, G Rock's demo radio show live every Sunday from 6 to 8. You can go to TuneIn Radio app. You should already be on there. Download the app, put in KTST FM, Anaheim.com. You can stun your cell phone. Or <coughs> tablet, and don't forget tomorrow night, go to YouTube, put in G Rock Demo Radio, and you'll be able to see Sean Roberts and Anne Marie 
Kira the video girl does a great job, about 7, 8-ish or 9-ish. It is a uh, school night, so she... She's got a lot of homework to do, you Yeah, know? she's got a lot of stuff. She doesn't have to deal with your stuff. She's got yeah. a lot of homework to do. <laughs> Poor Kira. <laughs> so check that out. Go to YouTube G-Rock Demo Radio. And like they're all in different orders. It'll say six weeks, one month, six month, a year. Just look for the one. You'll see the picture of them. And it'll say two hours, four hours. Just recently posted. Cool. All right. So we're going to do one here for you from the uh, the, the new album, uh, Upside of Heartache. And this is called All I Ever Needed, which Anna does a beautiful job as a duet. Okay. Thank you. All right. Here we go. Just a little shelter. 